Hey YouTube, this is Corey2281 here and I have great news for you guys who have been waiting for a jailbreak for the iPhone, iPod Touch, and iPad. Um, it seems that the dev team has just posted something on their blog about the Spirit jailbreak. Um, if you haven't heard about this yet, um, Muscle Nerd was actually using this on uh, his iPad a few, well, about three to four weeks ago, showing people that it can actually be jailbroken and stuff like that. Um, it's pretty nice because I have to say, I mean, it's going to be pretty amazing. Um, right now, they're saying that Spirit is an untethered jailbreak. Untethered means that you can turn off your device um, without having to boot it back up with the program. So that's really awesome. Thank God for that. <laughs> Spirit works on all devices. Thank you. All right. Spirit does not include a carrier unlock. Uh, doesn't affect me. But it's going to affect a lot of people out there who want to use T-Mobile or any unlocked carrier. So um, don't threat, guys. I'm sure they'll find something soon. So just hold on a little longer. Spirit requires your device to be activated or hacktivated. Now what this means is your iPhone cannot be at the um, connect to iTunes um, and emergency call thing, okay? It will not work. It has to be activated and all set to go. It doesn't have to be activated, but it does need to um, see this right here, okay? You have to be able to view your application and junk like that. You're not going to be able to, you know, actually use it if you're unlocked, but you'll still be able to access all your applications and junk. iPad and iPod Touch um, users, you won't have that much of a problem with that because you don't need to actually activate your iPod or iPad. <laughs> well, you do your iPad 3G, so we're going to have to try to find a way to get by that. But anyway, guys, that's pretty much it. So make sure that before you do try the spirit jailbreak, you're going to have to make sure that your device is activated and ready to be used. And last but not least, they got a little bitty thing down here that says, please make sure that your SHSH blobs are backed up. Um, the reason is um, there's supposed to be a new firmware coming out along with the new iPad. They're not 100% sure yet, but just in case there is, they're going to try to release that firmware like a day or two before the new iPad is released. So that way everyone will try to update to that new firmware and they will not be able to um, unlock it or, I'm sorry, jailbreak it. So they're going to try to mess with a few people. Apple is very tricky <laughs> when it comes to that stuff. That's why you need to make sure that you do read this blog. It will be down here in the video description, so please go check that out. Make sure that you read all of this. But anyway, guys, this is Koi2281. If you like this, please give me um, a good thumbs up down there. And hey, if you like my content, please subscribe by clicking the subscribe button up there. And I will see you guys later. Peace.